Very important topic here. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, a Kupuna falls every second, making falls the number one cause of injuries and deaths from injury among older Americans. So why do people fall, and what can you do to fall safely? There is a way to do it. We welcome Jennifer Kelly, physical therapist from the Outpatient Rehab Services at the Queens Medical Center for this morning's Ask a Specialist. Good morning to you. Hi, good morning. What, why do people fall? Oh, there are a few different factors. We split them up into external and, and internal or personal factors. So some of the external ones would be um, slipping on a wet surface or um, tripping over an object. And then internally, more um, leg weakness, decreased balance, um, having, taking a lot of medications or having decreased sensation in your feet. Those, those are some of the internal factors. Yeah, a, lot, a lot of our kupuna have slower reflexes as well, and, and that right. are some of the internal factors. Right. When you talk about what are the risks involved, and there are many risks in call, when it comes to falling, why do we need to learn how to fall? So learning how is really important to kind of try to minimize the amount of injury that we're getting. Um, they, and they range from mild, like bumps and bruises, to um, to moderate maybe having a wrist fracture or breaking a bone like a hip um, and then the more severe ones which can be fatal such as brain injuries those are life-changing events mm -hmm. right there so there are ways to fall safely and I, I want to call in your your model who's a good friend of mine blaze but uh, there are ways to fall safely maybe you can describe before blaze does a description because there, are, there you, the first thing you want to do is a lot of times to protect your head right Right, so the, the number one most important thing you want to do when you fall, whether it be forward or backward or to the side, would be to, to protect your head when you're going. Okay, um, other things that you can do to fall the right way would be to keep your body nice and relaxed, um, bending your, your limbs, and trying to turn to the side to mm -hmm. absorb the impact more on the fleshier parts of the body, like the thigh or the butt or, or the shoulder. So if you don't mind showing us, what, what are the, pr the uh, pr and as he demonstrates, so you can describe what he's doing. Sure. So if, if Blaze happens to start tripping and falling forward, he's going to bend his legs and then he's going to roll onto his side and get his hands up to protect his head. So, I mean, well, that can happen so quickly. Can Kupuna really learn to do that effectively? As you practice, mm -hmm. you, you would be able to, um, it becomes more of a reflex. Yeah, so so the, more you, the more you practice it, the better it would, it would be. And then it kind of helps with the fear of falling. Mm. Yeah, so if you know how to fall the right way, then when you're going down, instead of freezing up and tensing, where, where you tend to get more injured, you can, um, you can just go back to your training. Okay. And so that's where physical and, therapy And one more time, please, in. if you don't mind, because I noticed that he fell f on his elbows first. Is that what he did? Or he, 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 he was tr <laughs> yeah. He's trying to land on his, on his side, side, more like oh, on I his see. shoulder. Okay. And if, and if you are falling, what should he do? So if you've fallen and you're on the ground, mm -hmm. what you would want to do is to, to really just stop and relax, take a deep breath, see how you're doing. Check your body out for, for any injuries, and if you really feel injured, you want to stay put and, and yeah. call for help, whether it be with an emergency call device or using your cell phone to call 911, even um, getting um, your cane and mm -hmm. banging it so that somebody can hear and you and come in attention. to help you. Yeah. And to think, right, yeah, to right. think if you can. Yeah, and if you can get up, what you would want to do is try to move yourself over to a chair, put your arms on the chair, um, then get into a kneeling position, put your stronger leg forward, Stand yourself up slowly, turn, and have a seat. Okay. Now, if you're at a risk of falling, Queen's Outpatient Rehab or Re Rehabilitation Services can help you. They uh, have a dozen physical therapists at the Punchbowl Campus and at the Queen's Health Care Center in Hawaii Kai. They evaluate the treat issues related to falls as well as other uh, neurological conditions that you may have. If you need any help with these, just call the Queen's Outpatient uh, Rehab Services number. It's right there on the screen. We'll have all the information you need to know about the types of services being offered at uh, our website, khun2.com. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. It's a, it's a very important topic because so many of our kupuna fall every day. Right. It's life-changing.